Hey, what's going on everyone? Today is the 30th of March, 2023. Real quick, we're going to talk about NEO today because the particular market action recently is showing us that the market actually wants to go higher. I'm not going to say soar in price, but we can tell now that buyers are currently moving the market in NEO. So I wanted to come in and talk to you all about it real quick. I did a video in NEO on the 21st of March and I didn't do a price prediction. I wanted to show you and wait to see if buyers are going to continue to hold price in neo around nine bucks and you guys can see it since the 21st of march that that has actually been the case and then on yesterday's price action the market in neo actually closed higher around seven percent and on top of that you guys can see that the volume here in neo also came through as well so we have some catalyst that's being seen on the chart that will let us know that the market currently is giving us some strength look at neo on the two-day chart and here it is here you guys can see over the last two days again we see price close up here towards the high end of the bar decent amount of volume so the market is is coming off of what occurred on this two-day price bar on the 20th of march okay you guys can actually see it again on this two-day price bar in neo so even though we do see times to where neo price decreases it's these very widespread up bars that is telling us that the market is trying to break out and go up. OK, that's on the two day time frame. Let's look at Neo here on a three day. You guys can see it even again on the three day chart, how the market in Neo closed towards the high of the bar. And this is again coming off of this three day price bar as well as this one. So this is where we're noticing buyers in the market in Neo coming in. This is where buyers are. They're not letting the price in Neo go any lower than that right now so if price is being very reluctant into falling down in price here the only likely outcome is for price to go higher so that's pretty good too there on the three-day chart look at neo here on the five day okay so we've seen the completion of the two-day time frame the three-day and even here on the five day and these price bars is showing us that the market is definitely trending towards some bullishness price is looking to continue to, to move up higher in price now given that i've shown you all of that given that we can tell that market is is stronger than it is weak how high do you think price is going to go that's the next thing that we need to try to figure out now my first target though in neo at least in the next five days is going to be around 10.50 and then the second target is going to be around 11 or towards this downtrending line, which is drawn on the chart. Those are our first two targets. So even though we're bullish, even though we're expecting price to lift in NEO, we're not going to drop any outlandish target and tell you that NEO is going to run back to 50 bucks. That's asinine. This is not the type of game to where you want to come in and just throw out some targets. I want to be realistic. I want to show you all that we are only participating in the markets to get what it is going to offer to us yes i understand that everyone wants to hit the ball out the park hit a moonshot and completely profit from their position but that's not how the market works so let me go ahead and show you all what i think on those two targets that i talked about so that first target let me see was right there around 1050 okay that's 7.32 percent market move higher ten dollars and 55 cents that is going to be our first target and the second one's going to be up here towards 11. so we have 1050 first 11 dollars second or right here on this downtrend line let's say that neo pushes up here to this downtrend line which is drawn on our chart and price comes down that's our target okay because we've already established that this could be the price the level to which sellers will stage another comeback and push down neo's price so these are the two targets okay 1050 first 11 second now let's say that neo actually breaks outside of this downtrend then definitely we need to elevate our next target and then our next target will have to be here towards 11.81 12 dollars okay so 
that is it I'm done real quick real simple five minute video and this pretty much is what it should take to get ideas to how the market is trending and how it's trading so I'm done go ahead and give me your thoughts subscribe to the channel if you guys want more of a simplistic understanding how to as to how to forecast and predict prices I did say that you can predict where prices are going to go without confusion join me make sure you maintain the profitability and as always trade different